It's my yall or drug husband to she shraha sanara of his peladori and nervi, a gimmer to rena kaher a hobby, the sashach seag ach, er la velisha than darbly and as a hail hob a glahe canish line. Rod the healing in Ishbader, Gurbicha and Dora Fudden is far seguge. Samalta Lachanish Vider Shehulin Hunzera Thresh Karhan Numed, Achner Hosse Lehedi James Dolan, Kieran Martin, August Paul Shari, a great dro cool hill dara la funy of August La Mishnach. Well, the low action is coming. This is your third year on the trot, being relegated in the league. It's your second Leinster final in a row. How do you explain the two extremes? It's a tough one to get right. That it's very tough. I don't think it's as bad as what's been perceived right now. I think, being honest now and not being very arrogant, but I'd say Westmead, our Division Two team, we have. A lot of good players there that are talented footballers, the good, honest guys that give a solid hour's work in a game. Like that's what they're there for. But it's just from poor performances throughout that league, and I think a little bit of a rub of the green in some of them league games, where we were maybe like a point down or it was a draw game. We let that game slip in the last minute, or we had Tipperary at home. We drew there. I felt we could have took that game as well, and just two wins could have promoted us back up into Division Two. You know. I think we have a good future ahead of us if we can just start getting the balance between league and championship right. And Dolan has scored a goal. You were six points behind with 40 minutes gone against Kildare. What was the catalyst for that impressive comeback? Like we'd assessed Kildare before the game. We knew the way we'd have to play against them. We knew we were going to deploy two sweepers. So we kind of realised we'd have to get the ball up to around the 45 and then try punch holes. And in the first half, we just didn't do it. And at half time, the team talk was very much saying that that game was there to be tucked by the scruff of the neck. and. It'd be terrible if we let that game slip because we weren't aggressive enough in attack. So in the second half, they kind of got off to a better start, obviously getting their goal. And then we just we still knew what we had to do, and kind of Jimmy Dolan led the attack from wing back. We just had to break through tackles in the 45 and actually run at them. And eventually his runs paid off and when he got through for a goal and finished it well. And then after that was easy for the rest of us to kind of pick up on that momentum and carry on through. <laughs> Dublin are a different breed altogether. Like obviously our performance against Kildare, we know we're near good enough to even keep it in 20 points in Dublin. Never mind beat them. It's they're a very tough team to play against. Like if you try to swamp the defence, like they're a full forward line. Every player from going the whole way back from Philly McMatten up to the corner forward Bernard Brogan can kick points from 45 metres out. So if you try to press up on them, then you leave some of the three best full forwards in the county close to goals and the space slope not for goals to create. So they're a very very tough team to manage. Like last year we tried swamping. And we did well in the first half. I think we were three points down by half time. But like that, we had no attack system. We went up, like we attacked a bit in the first half, but because we couldn't get numbers up, we dropped, I think, seven short in the clucks in his hand. So I think it's the idea of trying to get balanced right now that we're able to try to contain them so you don't like face their full might of their scoring force. But we still try to put our own uh, attacking strategy into the game. <laughs> 